day guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and as you can see by the title, the gloves and the ball, I'm going to talk about things that I miss about playing cricket. Now I played cricket since I was about 9 or 10, um, I played all the way through to under 17s before stopping just before seniors. Yeah, I really enjoyed playing cricket, it was a good fun thing to do on my Saturday mornings over summer. I used to love bowling my leggies and at batting ninth. <laughs> So I'm going to go through a list of things that I miss about playing cricket and uh, what I miss about being around the cricket club. The first thing I miss about playing cricket is nothing. I don't miss anything. But the thing that I really did miss when I was at the cricket club was halfway through your team batting or your team bowling at about 10 o'clock, everyone got called up to the club rooms for a bit of a break, a bit of tea time. Boy was the cricket spread the thing that I missed the most about playing cricket. Jeez, you had your lamingtons, you had your sausage rolls, you had your sausages in bread, you had your bickies, your cakes, you had watermelons, you had grapes, muffins, little mini frankfords. They had everything, honestly. It was, um, it was, it was, it was bloody elite. Hated the kid who brought orange slices, it's not footy season. But apart from that, Everyone usually contributed. There's always that one kid that brought that Safeway mud cake. <laughs> There's always one of those lying around. I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining. Jeez, I do, I do miss those spreads though. I wish, um, yeah. I wish I could see one again. I just... G'day, my name's Caden McDonald. I'm 22. And, uh, yeah, I'm stoked that I'm on MasterChef. Yeah, cooking's never really been a passion of mine. I'm a little bit nervous because it's not quite the spread that I wanted to bring to Mr. Ramsey. Um, I don't have lamingtons, which is a crucial component. I don't have sausages in bread, but what I left out was orange pieces because it's it's not footy season. Um, I'm, yeah, I'm really nervous. I, I'm hoping Mr. Ramsey enjoys my food and yeah, that's about it. Next up is Caden McDonald with one of the most unique dishes we've ever seen on MasterChef. Gordon Ramsey is very skeptical of Caden's confidence. I don't know what to say. And what is this? I'm glad you asked. It's a, um, a traditional Australian cricket spread. Um, I've got my chocolate ripple cookies, pizza shapes. Now I know what you might be thinking. A pizza and a biscuit. Try it. Give it a go. The next thing I've got is two super dupers. Just to give you that real icy kick cool you down um, after a big day's play. The last thing I've got is what most of the boring parents bring, but that's all right. I've got a couple of strawberries and the most amazing cut watermelon. So as you tuck into it, Mr. Ramsey, I just wanted to say, how is that? <laughs> You're misinterpreting the competition. It's master chef, not master bait. You're not a fan. You really are a hack. Fuck you, Barry. Look, I'll be honest, extremely disappointing result. I thought bringing a spread to, uh, to MasterChef would hold me in good stead, but I don't care. I've got a lot more things to offer. Uh, Mr. Ramsey doesn't know a spread if it hit him in the face, and um, I'm gonna continue to, uh, to put together um, spreads, and um, hopefully one day, you know, I'll be recognised for that. I wouldn't eat that with your mouth. Why do you have to be so negative, Barry? He's such a prick. 